for some franchise mode again why am i doing the aiden english thing i have no idea Oof. she's gotta get this camera going yeah this will more than likely be the excuse me oh jeez i sorry sorry for hitting the uh thing here we'll be doing two of these one of these will be the classic and the other one being a expansion we're gonna start with the expansion team an expansion team we're gonna do a create we may do a third one down the line but let's get it started okay as for the team we're gonna go with the we did Seattle last year but there's another city that's been in the NHL market late very recently and I let's see that scenario let's go with Houston and honestly for Houston there was only one team team we could do let's bring back the Houston Arrows ah shoot That's right, this is the Houston Arrows GM mode for the expansion team. Now, honestly, is Arrows even on here? If not, I have to choose something. Jeez. Well, I guess Aces could go. I, well, I think we may have found the name of our mascot. I'm guessing now it's for the... Damn it, stop doing that. I guess we're going to use the Toyota Center YouTube. <laughs> Yeah, welcome to the YouTube Center, ladies and Damn it, stop doing that, Michael. Jeez. Here we go. Team colors, yes. Team prestige. We'll keep it at... Average market size, medium. Like a fan base is typical. We'll keep it a typical national fan base. Mm. Casual. Like a popularity. I'll put that in the high category because of the Houston Astros. His national popularity, I'll put that as average. Definitely. Do so, we'll go with that. All right now, logos and branding. Let's see, do we have any new logos for this year? I'm hoping we do. Hmm. See, uh, not much. Is Texas? I'm just curious. Is Texas on here? Because if it is, I think we may have a alternate logo. What? It is, but no offense, that logo fits the Definitely stars. Fits the more. stars a little more. Whew, let's see. Hello, alternate jerseys. I don't, let's see what the other logos are. Of course, there's font and... Oh, ECHL. Hello. Let's see. Is there a, anything we can use? The, nope. Why can't we use on... Well, the, we can use the Jets, but the thing is, I don't want it to be too predictable. No, is there, if there's vintage, thank you. The original Jets are going to be in here. No. Um, I am legit surprised. I am legit surprised. All right, let's see. We gotta look at something. Or the Houston Arrows.
you know what? Yeah, let's actually go through with it. Let's see what it looks like on the ice. Before we... Actually, that looks actually pretty good. Now comes the team colors. What the? Ow! Uh. Yeah, let's go with that. Yeah, let's go with the green. All right, let's see the col let's see the colors. There we go, beautiful. That is beautiful right there. Now secondary, hello. Now we can actually do this. All right, let's see, where's that other one? Because clearly I saw one that I thought fit the T. And, uh, oh, JD posted another video. I'll check that out later. We'll put that in. There we go. And let's see how this looks as our, uh, in our team color. Again, absolutely beautiful. I'm loving this. Alright, let's all right let's see it oh why not this should not be too bad all right let's see it beautiful all right there's the team colors for the Houston arrows now comes the top part, the jersey designs. <laughs> All right. Ugh. Okay, that's for it. That's for team design. I'm gonna go with the, let's see. Yeah, let's go with this one. All right, let's. Yes, nice. All right, logo. Friends, I guess we're gonna go with the front. I guess we're gonna go with. Oh, whoops, went the wrong side. Now let's go. No, yeah. I guess the when we do the helmet, we'll do the second one there. And yes, guys, I'll stock bidding. I actually know I'm gonna spin this mainly because of the thing here. Yeah, I'm gonna go with this font mainly because when Houston had a hockey team in the ECHL, I mean the American Hockey League. Prior to the, they were relocated to Iowa and they became the Iowa Wild. And, um, what? Um, okay, sure, let's go with that. I hope that doesn't go well with the white. With the road jersey. Pants style, we're gonna go with. You know what? I hate going. Oh, I was about to say. 
All right, this time, this is probably gonna be gonna be green. Yep, sure enough. I'll go. Last will be. Right's gonna be. There we go. Alright, socks. We're gonna. Hmm. Alright, we're gonna go with 19. There we go. There we go. State or equipment. Helmet. Okay, obviously that's gotta be green. Yep, beautiful. The decal. Obviously I want this to be the third jersey. I want this to be the third color. I want each of these. Comment number, that should be on, and I'm just, glove color, I'll be stunned, yeah, I was about to say, I'll be stunned if that was a different color, now, goalie equipment, blocker color, A oh, pad color. Okay, one more, and that's the stick color. All right, there we go. There's the. All right, now. All right away uniforms. I'm gonna go for the road one. I'm gonna go. this one. I know I'm going to get confusing. Why are you doing it this way? All right, let's see how this goes. Oh, okay. Cool. All right, front. Obviously, we're going to go with this. Oh, that looks great. Yeah, let's go with that. Let's make it confusing. All right, here we go. Now font, obviously we're gonna go with the Minnesota Wild again. Now I'm kind of curious to see how this goes for the font color. Here we go. Okay, that'll work. Okay, cool, that works. That works. All right, pants down, 19. All right, here we go. Sorry this is taking so long, folks. Now this one will feature the one logo. And it will be the helmet that's going to be. And this will be on the helmet. Socks we're going to keep. We're just going to change the color. And really? Helmet color. I hope this doesn't. It's not. Uh, go figure. It's white. We're gonna go this for the. Of course, that's on. And 
There we go. All right, now goalie equipment. And this is an endurance round. And I think I'm gonna have There we go. Now comes the alternate jerseys. Obviously, this one, I'm going to have a top swipe on this one. Is this a Jersey Style 30? Yep, sure enough. We're going to go with it. And let's see how this looks. Hopefully, it's silver. Uh, Jersey 33, wrong choice. See what this one is. All right, cool. We'll go with that. Yes, the main color has to change. Color wheel. And this one we're gonna. There we go. Alright, there we go. Okay. Yep, this will this will work. Alright, logos. Let's see, which one will work better? Yeah, no, yeah, let's go with this one, since this is the secondary. And obviously the only thing the alternate, the only thing the alternate jersey's gonna be on is the primary logo that's going to be on this team will be on the helmet. There we go. Again, I, do I even have to explain? Alright. Now, something tells me this is going to go wrong. The color font. Let's see. No, actually I like it. Let's go with it. Okay, we're gonna go with number seven. No logo, just, oh, why not? Let's do the logo. All right, let's see, white pants, primary. Right will be the Okay, all right. There we go. Socks, we're going to keep the way it out. They, the way they are, we're just going to change the colors. All right, there we go. Equipment. Oh, 
like I said, primary will be on there. Um, oh, it's the gloves. Okay. okay, yeah, let's make now that, that makes it kind of unique, actually. Let's go with it. There we go. Pad <sighs> color. All right. All right, I'm going to take a break because honestly, I really want to get into Animal Crossing. Well, at the same time, I'm going to take a look here because there is a feature I want to show off to you guys. So I'll be back in a little bit. All right, now it's time to customize the Toyota Center, a.k.a. the home of the Ariel. But we're going to start off with the architecture here. Honestly, I'm going to go with the... Oh, boy. Okay, not that old, not Joe Lewis Arena old or anything. Let's see, Pro Stadium number two, what's this one? That kind of fits to Toyota Center. Let's see. Oof. Let's see what 10 is. Okay, let's go with stadium number nine. Let's see how this looks. Yeah, stadium nine that has the press boxes. Okay, wall colors. All right, this should turn out good. Yeah, sort of does. Total color. There we go. Now roof color. Obviously, there should no come. Yeah, no shock. All right, Stumbotron. Now, unfortunately, they haven't exactly updated this, so I'm going. To, I think this is gonna be a tough call on this one. A tough call on this one, but I'm probably gonna go with this one. Scoreboard number three. Because honestly, that kind of fits what the Toyota Center scoreboard is. Netting color. We're going to go with white so they can see the puck better. Okay, now the seats. Honest pattern. Let's see. Let's see what pattern one is. All right, there we go. Pattern four we'll go with. Seat color one should be that, okay. Seat color two should be, okay. Let's go with that bit. All right, stairs and railings. Railing, if this is, if this is white, okay, good. I was about to say, if it's white, I'm, I'm leaving. All right, let's see. Boards and glass. There we go. Now, stats and material. This, sh I want this to be LED. All right. Now, ice. Oof. No logo layout. Let's see. Yeah. Now, which logo? Because honestly, I want this one to look, but I want to see which one looks better. We go with the home one. You know what? This will work. Now, the line doesn't. Let's see. Let's see. This will work. Let's go with this 21. Oh, honestly? Now, 
call me crazy. I think. Yeah, let's go with it. All the ice is done. Now it's time for the arena presentation. Now, unfortunately, I don't think we're going to have enough props for... For the arrows or anything. Nope. I think the best case scenario is the... Yeah, I think... That's probably the best case scenario, so yeah, let's go with that. No stanchion effects. Alright. No signature effects. Obviously, these, this is back from last year. Honestly, I don't know. Yeah, let's go with that. Restore our fire. Wait, we could actually. Can we really? Nope. Oh, well, that's a shame. Oh well. Oh well. Now, whenever there's a goal. Alright. Alright, let's see how this works. Just for curiosity, let's see what it looks like with the green. Nah. Yeah, let's keep it at white. Stator effect. Let's go with that. Stanchion effects. Oh boy, this is gonna be tough. We're gonna have a blink. No signature effects. Ooh. Yeah, I think the fire will use for the intro and the wind. Anything else will be the smoke or anything. Yeah, I think that's what we're gonna go for. Alright, that's four. We're gonna go with the vertical LED. Cause that is the future. Power play, let's see. Fan reaction. Let's see. Let's go with that. Now the win. The win. All right, outro. Now I think this should be the team salute. Yeah, we gotta go with that. Why not? Well, I guess the flames are gonna be used for the intro, I guess. Well, now go post color. This is the NHL. We're gonna keep it red. Who knows, maybe for the next creative one. Now comes the new features in the arena audio. And this is regarding the goal horn. Because either you can go with a preset or you could create your own. But for this one, for this created one, we're gonna 
create our own. Now, because honestly, we're going to go with... Oh, amount. We're going to have three blasts. Last night, oh, we got to be, we wanted to be, there we go, let's, delay, okay, oh, we got to delay, we're going to have a, Alright. Alright. Length will be medium. And the delay will be long. Let's see. Okay, yeah, we're not, that, by the way, that's not going to be the horn. Because obviously, that's what we're going to do. Now, where we're going to have, we're going to add it, obviously. So we're going to. Yes, we're definitely adding that. We're definitely adding that. Now, bass, we're gonna do. Yeah, this is... Damn it. Yeah, I think train one will work out nicely. Now for the mid. Oh boy. Now we're going to add this. We're going to add... And then we're gonna right now 
uh, for the tribal layer, we're gonna, oops, of course, we're gonna add What do you guys think? Tell me in the comments. Because honestly, that sounded really good. There we go. Corn has been created. Now for the so gold songs. Unfortunately, you can't choose one from the current lineup, which is pretty stupid. But I think we're going to use this one. No, no straps tap we're using that as our song. We're using that one. Oh boy. No, that's a power play song right there. Man, this is a tough choice. You know what, since it says real grand, you know what, I gotta choose that one. Now for a power play. Yeah, we're using that one, obviously. There we go. There we go. Now for preview. Let's see. Oh. Overall, not bad, not bad. At the Toyota Center. All is one thing left, and that's the mascot for this team. Obviously, we're going to do it with the mascot. Of course, I know this name is probably going to come a mile away. Some people say you should have done something with more creative. 
course we're gonna name him Ace. And of course, of course, we're gonna give him the number twenty-six because that's how old I am. Now, honestly, should we go with the eagle because that symbolizes flying? But we're gonna have to take a look and see. Oh, yeah, let's keep it. Let's keep it like this. Let's keep it like this. There we go. Now, well, as for his body, oh. Well, for one, I definitely want him to wear the jersey. Yeah, there we go, there we go. That's what I want. There we go. And there's Ace. And there's Ace, so let's go. Of course, this is my team, so I'm just gonna go with the ugh. Can I keep hitting this button? Of course, guys, I'll be jumping right into WWE once I'm done here for this evening. Shoot. Well, I guess I gotta go with Mike from LA. Apparently, Nintendo doesn't like the one. Uh oh. Thank you. There we go. All right, here we go. Of course, there's a lot of stadiums that have gone some with some changes in the terms of everything wise. Like for example. The Toronto Maple, well, the St. Louis Blues, their arena changed their name from Scott Trade Center to the Enterprise Center. And, of course, the Toronto Maple Leafs, shocker, shockers, scholarshiping fought out the Air Canada Center. Shocker, shocker. And, of course, Arizona, it's still the casino, I forgot its name. Now, in this game, they call it the Arizona Arena. Of course, now obviously now the Little Caesars Arena is in the game. All right, we're going to be choosing the Houston Arrows, and of course, yes, we'll customize the AHL team. Of course, we're not going to be calling them the Birmingham Aces, but instead, I'm going to be choosing. We're going to choose We're going to use Anchorage as our And for this team name, we're going to go with oof. We're going to go with the Anchorage Blizzards. All right, here we go. Let's see. There we go.
All right, logo time. Before we actually make the decision, we're gonna... Standard colors, we're gonna go with... All right, so... And finally, we're gonna go with Yeah, we're gonna go with those colors. And um. All right, for the term blizzard, we gotta do something. Let's see. Well, we can go with that or that. So we go with the husky as our logo. But let's see the vintage. Let's see what we could use. Well, we could use the old Oilers logo for it. We could, yeah, we got a lot of ideas we can go with, but. Let's see. Alright, why not? I doubt they're gonna come back anytime soon, but let's use this as our our logo. Because it's the same pick. Our alternate logo is the Husky. Oh, let's see. Is there another logo we can use that simulate a blizzard? Please? Nope. Nothing. And I guess we're going to use this as our... Alright, I'll show you guys the uniforms when I'm done. Well, See you guys I'm deciding. I decided to change the... Hus take the Husky out, move the flag into the secondary, and the Tanieri will be the old, the Vancouver Canucks Tanieri logo with Johnny Canucks. So, just to let you guys... Oh, on that one. See you guys in a little now, bit. Before we uh, continue on here, I would like to address something. Ooh. I want to show you guys the uniforms that I have uh, created for the Blizzards. Of course, here's our home jerseys. Let me rotate here. This is where the rotation will be good. Our way. And our alternates. Which one's your favorite jersey of the six jerseys you saw? Tell me in the comment section below. Now comes the arena. And honestly, I, I'm having a really tough time here. Either I'm going to go with the, the Junior Stadium, the Junior Semi-Pro, But in the end, I decided, you know, I could go semi-pro because that kind of fits the American Hockey League style, style which is why I'm going to go with why I'm going to go with the Junior Stadium because at least this somewhat fits like a standard American, what you see in Alaska. Hopefully, bro. Hopefully I didn't offend anybody. 
and color wall. This should be the no. Yep, there we go. That's that tunnel color. There we go. Ooh. Yep. I was going to say if this was one, I'll be walking away. All right, scoreboard. Honestly, this could go either way, but in the end, I want to go something old that kind of fits it in the current era here, but. I I guess we can go with this one for the time being. Because at least it covers that gap in the wall. So, yeah, why not? Let's go with the big one. Not in color. Well, this the main team is white. Why don't we go with black for the American Hockey League team? So, now seats. What pattern should we do? Obviously, we're stuck with. All right, here we go. Let's go with five. See one. Let's see. There we go. And for C two, let's see how this goes. Okay, that'll work. Stairs and railings. There we go. And I gotta say, this stadium reminds me so much of the, the Coliseum in Toronto. Trim color. This will be blue. Now, stanchion material. Should I go LED? You know what? Yeah, let's go LED. Why not? Now, the ice color. Oof. This is going to be a tough call. This should be a Pretty tough decision in terms of layout. Because I could go the. But honestly, I'm. You know what? I'm going to go with the, the way that Nordiques had it back in their day. And where's Montreal? There we go. <laughs> A little nod, so to speak. All right. Now comes the effects. Intro. Now, obviously. No, just like this. There we go. Substantial effects. There we go. Signature effects. Now I think this. <laughs> there we go. There we go. Obviously, there we 
go. We'll go with that. Yeah, I guess we'll go with that. Now that's for curiosity, let's see. Oh yeah, I like that. I like that. Let's go with that. Let's go with that. Because obviously this should be a goal. So let's just your effects. Now this is where the... Yeah, because why not? This is where the effects should be. Unlike the American Hockey League team. Now to keep the old school look, we're going to keep the classics in here. All right. Now power play presentation. This is obviously going to be fan reaction. Oh, I can go with this. Yeah, let's sure. Why not? And as for a win, of course. Oh, we can't do that? Well, that sucks. So Paul's coming to this fight. Now it's time for the arena audio. Now I'll go hard. Now I would do the preset ones, but like I said, we're gonna create. We're gonna we're gonna create our own here. We're gonna go three blasts. Our first blast is going to be short. <sighs> the way is going to be short. Last number two will be short with a short delay. But the third one All right, let's see. here all right now comes the sounds Sure, we'll go with that. Of course, for mid, we're going to go with... All right, let's see how this goes. Okay, we gotta go with something a little. Oh, let's see. Okay. 
Yeah, man, I'm having a little bit of... Whose horn, is, whose horn is better? Tell me in the comment section below. Now it comes the flare part. Oh. Alright, let's see. Of course we did the siren. That's out. There we go, perfect. There we go, perfect. That's what I like to see. Now, oh, the song, shoot. Now, songs, whew. So, now fly to the Valkyries. Oh, fly to the Valkyries. All right, let's see. Are you kidding me? Okay, if this is not with the blues, I'm going to be mad.
All right, let's go with this one. Why not? Have this be our win song. Is the Blizzard's win song as well? Yeah, we're definitely gonna have that as our win song. Cause honestly, Again! Now let's go with that for our, the song, for the power play. Other than that, this looks really good for the Anchorage Blizzard. So, let's go. All right, let's begin. All right, we're gonna be in the central with Dallas, which makes absolute sense. Ready to go, career. The, si the firing will be off. Finances, that's on. There we go. Let's begin. And we'll, we, we'll keep the salary cap on because I want a challenge. All right, we'll do the st expansion draft and then we'll uh, I'll announce who I would choose for the my regular team of the 31 teams. Still getting used to 31, though. And by the way, last year's choices, I never got a chance to get to one. What choice would have been the Arizona Coyotes last year? This year, I know which team I'm using, and I'm not going to be using it. All right, here we go. Let's begin. All right, advance to the... Oh my god, our new scouting system, we'll talk more about that. Fog of War, let's see. Vince Holtz, I don't know who that is. Alright, here we go, expansion draft. The Houston Arrows, let's go. Tap. Not bad. Draft lottery, we will, and we'll be doing the regular draft too. Where are we? Houston fourth overall, not bad. Alright, here we go. Alright, here we go. Expansion draft time. Let's see who, who we're gonna. Oh, we're gonna do it by. All right, here we go. All right, from the Anaheim Ducks. The Anaheim Ducks. From the Anaheim Ducks, the the Houston Arrows are proud to select John Manson. From the Arizona Coyotes, the Houston Arrows select. Really? This is all they wrote. Marcus Kruger. From the Boston Bruins, the Houston Arrows select Rick Nash. O'Reilly Nash, excuse me. From the Buffalo Sabres. The Houston Arrows select Matt Molson from the Calgary Flames. 
the Houston Arrows select Curtis Lazar from the Carolina Hurricanes. The Houston Arrows. The Houston Arrows select Carrick from the Chicago Blackhawks. Jeez, I was hoping to get a goalie, but jeez. The Houston from the Chicago Blackhawks. The the Houston Arrows select. Patrick Sharp. All right, let's see. We got we gotta get a goalie from the Colorado Avalanche. The Houston Arrows select Philip Grubauer from the Columbus Blue Jackets. The Houston Arrows select Mark Matestu. From the Dallas Stars, the Houston Arrows select Dan Hamnoose. All right, here we go. Now we're at Detroit. From the Detroit Red Wings, from the Detroit Red Wings, the Houston Arrows select. Trevor Daly from the Edmonton Oilers. Edmonton Oilers. The Houston Arrows select Adam Larson from the oh, from the Florida Panthers. The Houston Arrows select. Connor Brickley. Whew, here we go. From the Los Angeles Kings. From the Los Angeles Kings. The Houston Arrows select Justin Auger. From the Houston Air, from the Minnesota Wild, from the Minnesota Wild, the Houston Arrows select Tyler Anus. From the Montreal Canadiens, the Houston Arrows select David Lemko. From the New York Islanders, the Houston Arrows select Dennis Seidenberg. From the New York Rangers, let's see, got the goalies. The Houston, no, the Houston Arrows select Jasper Bass. From the Nashville Predators, the Houston Arrows select Nick Bonino. From the New Jersey Devils, New Jersey Devils. New Jersey Devils, the, the Houston Arrows select Ben Lovejoy. Jeez, this is gonna be this one's gonna be a tough one. From the Ottawa Senators. From the Ottawa Senators, the Houston Arrows select Prahari.
from the Philadelphia Flyers. The Houston Arrows select Jordan Wheel from the Pittsburgh Penguins. The Houston Arrows select Carl Aglin. The San Jose Sharks. The Houston Arrows select Justin Braun from the St. Louis Blues. The Houston Arrows select Carter Hutton from the Tampa Bay Lightning. Ooh, jeez, I got a tough call here. From the Tampa Bay Lightning, the Houston Arrows select Anton Strawman. From the Toronto Maple Leafs, the Houston Arrows select Roman Pollock. From the Vancouver Canucks, Canucks, the Houston Arrows select. I go right wing. Nope, nothing. The Houston Arrows select Michael Delzato from the Washington Capitals. The Houston Arrows select Jay Eagle from the Winnipeg Jets. The Houston Arrows select Steve Mason. Wait, we didn't get one for Vegas. What the hell? Well, there you guys go. These are the inaugural members for your Houston Arrows. Wait, I have to select a goalie? There we go. Let's finish the draft. Apparently, we didn't get one for Vegas, apparently. So, there, these are the first part of the Houston Arrows. And who thought, who had ever thought, oh, we can't do it. <laughs> Here we go. Let's see. All right, here we go. Let's All right, here we go. Draft time. Let's see what we get here. Montreal got the first overall pick, which, yep. So we're gonna send to our pick. Dolly went to the Sabres, as predicted. Banty went number one to Montreal. And Shipnikov went to Ottawa. Now it's our turn. Here we go. Well, let's see. Who should we go with? We have a chance to get a medium elite player here, so I can't go wrong here. <sighs> All right. Let's look at the goalie. Let's see what we got here. Goaltender Mac Jordan could be good elite. All right. I think I got it. I got it. All right, with the fourth pick in the entry draft, the Houston Arrows select from the Halifax Moosehead, Philippe Zadina. All right, let's 
them to the next breath so we can see how everybody did. Uh, let's see. Ah, can we see everybody? Please. Oh, trap door. Let's see. Goaltender. Right, All right. Gonna, here we go. Let's take a look at it. Let's see. Who did the Kings and who did everyone else did? Jeremy went to Arizona. Wolf went to Detroit. Adam Brockwith went to Vancouver. Doug went to Chicago. Spencer went to the Rangers. Molino went to uh, Edmonton. Ryan McLeod went to the Islanders. Nick Dobson went to the Hurricanes. Bouchard went to... Uh, Bouchard went to the Islanders. Lundstrom went to Dallas, which I think that actually did happen. Smith to Philly. Contatiemi went to Florida. I don't know why the hell Montreal went with him with the third overall pick. Burgundy to the Avalanche. <laughs> That's funny. Willis went to New Jersey. Young to the Blue Jackets. Harvey went to the Kings. Yalian went to the Flyers. Blake to the Sharks. Finley to Ottawa. Hammings went to... Let's see. There's Rasmus Kapari went to the Rangers. Oh, wow, that's actually kind of kind of ironic. And Akil Thomas, who fell to us, went... All right, let's zoom to our pick. All right, let's see. Ooh, a pick. We, we can... Oh, there... You know what? Sure, let's do it. All right, let's make our pick. Who should we go for? Ooh, jeez. I mean, we got a lot of good choices here. Oh, another elite player. All right, I guess we'll probably pick him. With the 44th overall pick in the entry draft, the Houston Arrows select from Osberger Panther from the German Hockey League, Lucas Fritzmeier. All right, zoom to the next round. What the, ah. Well, I had to learn this eventually. All right, I did not mean to trade. Let's zoom to our next pack. I don't believe there's another, all right, here we go. All right, let's see. Oh, another elite medium. Oh, jeez, and I got to choose. Oh, boy. Whew. All right. All right, with these. Oh, boy. I got a, I, let's see. I want to Let's see how many goalies we got. Let's see, goalies. All right. All right, here we go. With the. 67th pick in the entry draft. The Houston Arrows select from the Swedish Hockey League, HB71, Max Jordi. I hope I pronounced that right. All right. Next pick. And I think we got it. Oh, we got back to back picks here. So whoever I like, we can get in the next pick. Let's see. All right. Oh, hey, Kings prospect here with the 99th overall pick. The Houston Arrows select Aiden Dudix from the Owen Sound Attack. So we finally got that one done. Whew. All right, let's see. All right, let's see. Should we choose as our Tarasa? Ooh, low elite. With the 100th overall pick, the Houston Arrow select Adrian Dice. Low elite, so we'll see how this goes. All right, let's see our next pick. All right, let's make our selection. Ah. 
So all legs. All right. Let's see, who should we choose? Oh, well, all right, with the 131st pick, the Houston Arrow select for the Charlottetown Islanders, Hunter Drew. All right, next pick. And, uh, let's see. All right, with the 163rd pick, the Houston Arrow select from the Saginaw Spirit, Caleb Everett. All right, if that up top guy is still up there, we'll take a, ooh, another goalie. We got, ooh, a medium elite goalie. All right, with the 191st pick, the Houston Arrow select from the Lottie Pelicans in the Finnish Swedish League, Jakob Sh Sharek. Skarek. Gotta get, gotta get used to saying the guy's name. And with that, that's the draft. Let's take a look at our picks. Nearly an epic fail there. <laughs> and there's the Houston Arrows. Led by Felice Zadina. Here we go. And with that, that's going to conclude our episode, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe. Coming up next, we're going to find out who my team is for NHL 18 in real life. Before another team, before a hockey team comes to Houston. Thanks for watching, guys.